apparently clicking things. Sorry that you just get my ugly, disgusting desktop. There we go. Open the game. Okay, to anybody who was watching the live stream for a second there and then had it disappear on them, I am sorry. Uh, my OBS was acting really weird. So. I don't know how to open this again because I already opened it, but today is my birthday and I'm wanting to... I'll do a birthday live stream. Um, so thank you everybody who joins me. And today we are going to just be exploring outward. Very simple stuff. Got some music in the background. Got some good vibes going. So we're going to go ahead and just continue and go into Hermotten. Mind you, my game is modified. And I just realized... Oh, dang it. Oh my gosh. There we go. That was probably stuff you guys shouldn't have seen, but it's out there now for the world to see. Hi, Grayscale. Thank you. Appreciate it. So far, it's a good birthday, so... Uh, I don't know where to even start exploring yet, and my character is still set up for an old... Uh, old video that I did. I don't see anything good, but yeah, so I'm just kind of wanting to explore, kind of go into some, oh, I don't know. I guess we'll probably start with Sierzo and kind of just explore around the terrain. We're going to share an ace new terrain. That should take us not to Sierzo, but it'll take us to share an ace. So... Okay. Oh, actually, it did take us to Sears, though. And it is leaked. That's alright. Our weapons are more than likely going to disappear here in a second. So, I know with the definitive, edi the definitive edition, they added new areas. And... I don't know of any of the ones in the Sheeran Ace region, but... I guess I'm just going to explore around and try to find some caves and whatnot. See, this is the fun part because now you guys get to see just like all the boring stuff. Like if anyone's played this game, they know that there's a lot of boring stuff. But to anybody who hasn't played the game, it's a lot of this. Just a whole bunch of this. Like I can't even express to you how much of this it is. Boom, like a baseball bat. No mask, no mask. I'm never gonna get one. Like I've made videos on how to get masks and I have gotten masks in other playthroughs, but I don't think I'm ever gonna get one in this playthrough. So this is, yeah, yeah, this is the troglodytes camp. I don't really need anything here. Yeah, Blister Burrow. I don't think there's anything too good here. I'm going to move on to no another area. We've got a cliff face that we are probably going to die from. Luckily, the devs did some awesome stuff like this for people like me. Where we have little areas we can run across. I just realized it's snowing. How did I not realize this? Oh, I swear.
So we got Montclan's clan fort and or Montcalm. And then around this way we'll have like Ghost Pass, I think. I kind of just want to go to like Three Brothers or something like that and explore instead. Because at least I know those areas. Not, I don't know those areas that well, so they tend to be a little fresher for me. Because I've only played the Sorborian DLC twice, both for the channel, and I've only played Three Brothers once, and I had very little exploration in that in that one, so it's not like it was a crazy experience for me or anything. The music needs to come back. There we go. It's funny because I hit shuffle on the music and uh, yeah, it didn't shuffle. It's playing it in order. I can't go through here because there's the switch for it. I, mean, I can always turn on no clip and go through, but that's no fair. So not there. Avoid the traps. They both should be on the same side. Yep. Oh, and man, it is hot in here. <laughs> it's not, it doesn't usually get this hot in my room until after like a couple hours of recording. But I've only been streaming for six minutes. My computer's been on for like a max of probably ten. And I, it is sweltering in my room. It is hot where I'm at. This unprecedented heat wave is freaking amazing. I, uh, I heard him. Where? There he is. Go ahead and throw this up and bam. Oh, I missed. That was because I never tabbed onto him. That's my own fault. Nope, no mask. No mask. That's to be expected. Oh, I'm cold. Um, I have warm stuff, right? Yeah. Slam that in my face. There we go. Because I know, I think the armor that I have on already resists cold. Yeah. So this armor is probably going to suck in the in the Brotherhood's DLC. Brotherhood. Uh, three Brothers. This isn't Skyrim. I have been playing Skyrim a little bit. Skyrim and uh, Cyberpunk. I'm playing that a little bit more. It's fun. It's just... I don't know. Cyberpunk's one of those games, like, it's only good one one time through, really. And then after that, it's kind of just... Meh. Skyrim's good. I mean, that game's been out for, like, 12, 11 years now. So, I mean, it's still an oldie and a goodie. Can't wait for 6, though. That'll definitely be a game that I play on my channel. So, over there... We got, is this right where that little truss, truss thing is? It's like a collapsed bridge. That would be the Immaculate's camp, which I've already been there. So there's no reason to go there. Uh, we don't want to go up there. There's no, There's nothing up there, really, except for... Uh, a way to get into the mountain and don't you run from me but a way to get into the mountain and a sword a rusty sword I believe 
And there's like no real reason to have that sword. It doesn't do anything. This pearl bird is going to kill me. This is why you need some distance attacks. I am going this way anyways, dude. So you can keep running forever if you want. Doesn't bother me any. Like he knows I'm here. There's no way he doesn't know. Yep, there it goes. Nope, oh, wrong button. What sucks about these guys too is like, you see how he's on this mountain? He can run up this mountain. I can't. Oh, I can. Hey. Gotcha. No mask. Got some bandits. Got a bunch of bandits. We got two there, two there. Jeez. Yeah, right. Woot. Outward. Um, I want to say it's been a while, but it hasn't. But hello there. <laughs> okay you know what um try to remember my buttons here i think it might be r nope but uh that did something cool leave it to me to not know my layout so it, it's, it was two that I was looking for, because that infuses the weapon. And then... Oof. I never use that elemental discharge. Elemental discharge. I never use that attack. It's just, uh, it's cool. It is cool. Never use it. Uh, we can do Yazan's boat. I don't think I've ever really fully explored that. I think last time I was on it, uh, I kind of just like cut and edited it right past it. We can check it out real quick. I don't think there's really anything in it. I think it's more... I think it's actually under it. Now that I think about it. Yeah, like right over here. Because if you come here without any indication to, I don't think you get anything from this chest. Or you can, but there's like a false bottom that you don't know about. So, whoop. let me mute that real quick. Boop. And on top of that, actually, let me mute my phone. Small things that you forget to do. Looks like I could use high stash containers some smaller that should search panels, which. Oh, there's a code. Um, I don't know the code, so we will leave. Cause I know it's kind of, I know it's something cool. We can actually just Google it. Should I Google it? No one's watching anymore. Ah, I wouldn't hurt to Google it. Ah, don't fault me, people. Don't fault me. But see, I have done this before, so it's not like... It's not like it's anything crazy for me to do this. I've done it before. So, yes, view page. We're going to enter.
So... Oh, <laughs> uh, it's Moon and Star. That is so simple. Yeah, you find it out right after leaving, uh... Hello, Isaac. Yes, I am back. I've been back with Outward for a while. It's just, uh, I've been doing the Defensive Edition, then I took a break for another little bit, and now I'm kind of back again. Uh, anyways. Nice, stuff's coming with me. Yeah, I'll take it. So, got a Rondel Dagger, 35 silver, and a Gadbury Wine. Pointless stuff, really. And we've been over there, because that's how we got our Lightmender's Lexicon. And... I mean, we can always explore the Vigil Pylon. But there's like really nothing at those. They're cool, but there's really nothing there. I guess let's head out to... To Berg. Isaac, it's good to be back. It really is. Um, I really do like Outward. Outward's a really fun game. And a lot of people give it... You know, give the devs hell for it, but... Personally, it's a really fun game. And you know what? I'm not going to waste the rations for it because the rations are for my playthrough. So we're just going to go to Berg. My character needs a rest anyways. We need repair. So, oh, I'm cheating. Um, I've let everyone know for a long time that I've been doing this. <laughs> I don't spawn items. I actually farm my items and everything. I just, it's for teleportation because it makes it so much quicker for me to do my videos. I don't have to waste two to three hours doing one 30 minute or even one 10 minute video. I can just boom, go. It's nice. Let's rest up our character real quick. And I guess we can also go to the store and see if there's any potions or anything. Sleep. Oh, that's going to burn our man. Oh, well, uh, repair. Let's just go for a full day. We're not. We're not, we're like in between missions, so we don't got anything going on. I'm glad my videos helped you out, man. Um, sorry that there's a lot of space in between the comments, in between the replies in the comments. Uh, YouTube is weird and it has a latency thing, so it's like 10 seconds behind. Excuse weird noises that, I'm not drinking soda. Uh, but yes, I am glad the videos had helped you. I really do. Um, <laughs> at least some people like my videos, uh, not, not a lot of people do, which is fine. I mean, to each their own, my playthrough is just not good for some people, I guess, because I kind of just run in and bash things in the face and hope and hope I live. Uh, and yeah, some people don't like that. As you can tell, in between live streaming and actual records... Oh, what soda do I got? I have... Uh, so we have this sandwich joint here called Zloshki's. And I have a strawberry Dr. Pepper. It's really good. Don't push me. It's really good. Um, yeah, you get them from one of those weird Coke dispensing machines that has like seven or eight different flavors per soda. Weird. Oh, uh, what was I doing? Oh, I'm going to buy a couple of these. Uh, buy three. And we'll buy one of these. No, we won't buy one of those. Buy some of these. Oop. And confirm. And we're going to... We don't need mana right now. We've got mana regeneration anyway, so burnt mana is no issue. Where do we go from here? Oh, I feel like I was saying something. I have ADHD. So, like, live streaming is not really good for me because never taste a strawberry pepper. It's really good. Um, it's weird because, like, the first time you drink it, it's kind of gross. But then it kind of grows on you. Sort of like the whole Dr. Pepper Jazz, which was, like, cherry vanilla Dr. Pepper way back in the day. Have you tasted Coca-Cola Starlight? Coca-Cola Starlight. So... Th I don't know, the marketing gimmick got me because it was like, taste the stars and all that jazz. So yes, I have had Coca-Cola Starlight and it is okay. <laughs> it's just okay. I I wasn't a huge fan of it. Uh, it. I don't know, to me it almost tasted just like a Coke. 
Like, it didn't have anything extra to it. It was, like, slightly there. Uh, oh, yeah. I have ADHD, so um, live streaming with comments and having to reply to people <laughs> is completely confusing to me because I get, I get like, so sidetracked so easily. Um, and... With the sidetracking, I guess this kind of leads into like a previous thing I was saying. I do a lot of us, and you don't notice that in my normal videos. Like you'll notice that slow talk that I do every now and then in my normal videos, but you won't notice the us as much because I hate my us and I cut my us out. Ah, that was a lot. <laughs> that was a lot to say. But yes, I have tried Coca Cola Starlight. Just bringing that back around. Ah, uh, nothing good. That doesn't look good for my wrist. Ooh, I guess I can go... This way. Is it this way? The, um... Face of the gods or something like that? How do I like the definitive edition? Definitive edition. Um, so, ooh, flaming arrows. I don't really do arrows anymore. Anyways, um, I like it. I do. It does look a little bit better, like this whole misty stuff, and some of the graphic details are better. I haven't noticed too much in the lines of new areas to explore. I don't know if it's just because I'm not looking for them, but I'm not noticing much in, uh, along those lines. Overall, stability seems a little bit better. I'm not crashing as much as I used to because I used to have quite a few crashes back in the day. That no longer an issue. And for the most part, it just kind of feels like the base edition minus the crashing and it looks a little bit better. It's more stable. I get higher frame rates. That's about it. <laughs> uh, have you have you tried the definitive edition yet? Yeah, this one. Two. I know there's enemies up here. There typically is. They're typically uh. What are those things called? Golems? I think that's what they're called. If there are any up here, that'll annoy me because I just wasted my last warm potion. Cool. Haven't tried. Haven't yet. Is it your birthday? Yes, it is my birthday. Um, <laughs> I have leveled up. Ooh, I can enter these? I didn't know you can enter these. I'm not going to lie have not and en never entered one of these before uh but yes it is my birthday uh everyone asked me what i wanted to do for my birthday and i was straight up front and honest i'm like i just want to stream for an hour or two and kind of just do my thing oh is it just the chest oh i hear stuff that's cool not Something I would totally grab, but that's cool. Birthday, dude. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. And it's it hasn't been a bad day. I worked. And... Oh, there's a lever. Hi there. Wow. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I worked. I had a, a good shift. And... Then I came home and my wife went to work. So I made dinner and took her some dinner, you know, to be really nice, to be a good husband. And then I ate and started recording. Wow. Did I really kill him in one hit? Because I know I 
smashed his shield a lot, but I think he just like in one hit. Let's find out. Oop. Yeah, God, I love this build. But yes, it was a good day so far. Okay, so that didn't work. So this one. This one. This one. I guess we'll go with this one. That didn't work. Talk about being OP. Dude, this build is good. I really like it. This is a Mystic Flame Knight. So, general general things. So we use the runic blades, uh, which you have to summon with the runes. Uh, we have the antique plate shallot with economy to boost or to reduce mana cost and stamina cost. Uh, the antique plate garb also with economy. Plate boots with economy. Uh, Bozo hide backpack just because it helps us roll. And... Lightmender's Lexicon, which basically just gives us a little bit more bonus and mana cost. Reduced mana cost. So, like, yeah. Good build overall. Okay, so it's going to be straight. Stop hitting me. I can keep swinging forever, dude. I have infinite mana. Or mana, stamina. Oh, we have no potions. I should have bought some. I know you can heal with potions. Or not potions. Uh, you can heal with runes. Never figured it out. We'll go this one. We'll go the close one this time. Oof. What is this? It's breathing at me. I feel like if I touch it, I'm going to die. Oh. Nope. Okay. I don't know what that's about. Okay, so there's three here. Got chest too. Arcane robes. Uh, they sell for a little bit. We'll go ahead and take those. Oh, there's another chest. Oh, it's the same chest. Okay, so that takes me to there. So this one, I guess. Oh, we are so close to dying. Ah. Uh, nothing good. I think this is the end of this area, though. We got a flintlock pistol, rage potion, general crap. There's a building off in the distance. So question, have, have you seen this area in the base? I certainly have it. <laughs> well, that was cool. Uh, I don't know what that fire was about. But that was cool. We're definitely going to need to go back to Berg and buy some health potions and stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of grab whatever and fill up our inventory. And me being the dirty cheater I am. There's a legacy chest in there. Oh. I've never unlocked the legacy areas. How do I get to it? How do I do it? <laughs> you can help me out. It was in the base game too. Okay, yeah, I've never done legacy chests. I've never messed with those. 
So it was this one. And then... Oh, okay. So did I have to kill everything in here to do it? No, I didn't do anything. Okay. But it looks different whenever I'm further away from it. Is it just a puzzle? Like that I have to figure it out? Okay, those are just taking me to the exact same spot. It's a puzzle. You have to go through different portals until you reach the chest. Okay. I assume this is, I assume it's not just like a standard chest either. It's going to look different, like an ornate probably. Probably gonna be over there that fire is at. Cause that fire looks weird whenever I'm at a distance, but once I get close to it, it kind of turns normal. The orb has to turn white. Okay. I probably will look it up on the wiki um, at a later time because now that I know that it's here I kind of know how to get here so I'll worry about that some other time we're gonna go ahead we're gonna go back to Berg uh, which I have to no I don't have to leave that was a weird sound yeah we'll, we'll go ahead and go back to Berg we're low on resources that was the wrong one. But we're ever low on stuff anyways, so... We're almost dead. <laughs> that's cool, though. I've never messed with that legacy chest, so... That, that's kind of something new to me, because I know there's one... In Sharonese that I would mess with. Is it in Sharonese? I don't even remember where it's at anymore. It's been so long since I messed the legacy chest because I just mainly did one build and ran with that. That might be something interesting to look up into. Have you finished a quest line with this character? Yes, I have. I have finished... Uh, not that one, not that one, not that one. This one. So now I'm on Fallen City. So for Caldera, for Three Brothers. So I have done... Under Sierzo. Yes, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, I, I, I knew the, the one under Sierzo. But I did the base one. And. Is it Mixed Legacies? No. Castaway? No. I don't know where it's at, but I also did. Uh. Uh. Sorborians with this character, too. Now, we can get some potions. Cool, so can get infused mana. Infuse mana. Uh, I have infused fire. <laughs> I don't have infused mana. Um, I you get that from the the college, right? The, the college, the whatever it is, the Sorbor Academy. How can I help you? 
Never thought about using that or getting that. So we'll get these. We'll get these. We'll get these. Yeah, you know what? We'll get these two. Fair. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. See, this is my first mana build, so like, I never really paid attention to where certain things were for mana characters. Which, to be fair, I actually like mana a lot. One of these. Manual. This. This. There we go. So I guess we can head out on this side and go check out Face of the Gods. I think it's what it's called. It's an area I've always wanted to explore, never explored, and completely forgot about, to be honest. It's powerful. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going to have to check it out. Because I like Infused Fire. Infused Fire is pretty good. Uh, most enemies are weak to fire, so it kind of works out. Unless you get some that aren't, like, because they're bursting on fire, then, uh, yeah, fire's kind of pointless then, but Infused Fire's pretty good. That's why it's called the Mystic Flame Knight, but. <laughs> oh. I am spacing out. I'm tired. It's been a day. Yeah, there's a hand, so it should be over here. It's so weird, because, like, I'm watching my stream. It's off on the side on mute, and I can see how delayed it is. And it's so weird, because there's, like, a solid, like, 10-second delay. I know, it's because of YouTube's uh, processing and whatnot, but it's just weird. Uh, yes, Face of the Ancients, that's what it's called. I've never messed with this area. Like, I went down there once, but... Is my straw broken? No, guess not. But yeah, I've been I've been in here once, but I've never actually explored. Cause there's yeah, there's a person here. What now? You there! You look like a capable explorer. Might hire you for something. I heard Blood Red Idol hidden in this place. Offer you three hundred silver to bring it to me. Shh. Sure. Up with you. Oh, fuck you too. So don't infuse fire. Did I ever buy infuse? I don't think I ever did. I only got fire. Do I have any cool potions? Nope. Okay. Oh well, we'll go in like this. We'll be fine. Uh, how do I get down there? Oh, it's over on the side. Hello? Let me kill you. Ow. That wasn't good. <laughs> That's what happens when we just rush, though. Which I am very well known for that. Oh, look, some are already dead. That's so sweet of them to be dead for me already. Is 
Like, I know I'm going to run into the Wendigo. That's going to be, like, a guaranteed... Ooh, there's a frost horse, or frost horse, fire horse down there. Don't want to mess with that. Boom! That was close. And we'll mess with that. Oh, I hate those things. I'm hot. Thank you. Come through. Missed me. Oh, please be a cold area. Thank Jeebus. See, now this is what I'm well known for. Just running. Actually, I can kill you pretty easily. I swear I am holding lock. Forget it. Yep, I knew that was going to happen. I could have sworn I was holding block, so I don't know why he kept hitting me. <sighs> That's my own fault, though. Yeah. We were holding blocks, so I don't know what that was about. Cold. What is that? What is that? Why, why have I never seen that? Disease. I have Mika fever. Thirst will deplete 100%. Oh, that sucks. Okay, well, we're fine now. Thank. That's a new disease. That's a definitive edi definitive edition disease for you. Ooh, Paladinium. Paladinium doesn't hurt to have because you can always sell it. So tomb key required, so that means I need to start searching these guys because one of them might have the key, and I never thought about it. So that's that's kind of on me. Ah, wrong way.
Ah, wrong way. Keep going the wrong way. Okay, so what's over here? Hmm. Yeah. Go ahead and take that potage. Oh, going down. Down some more. Chest. I hear something. Whoa, when to go? Oh, when to hell no, getting out of here. Ornate chest. So we're going to fight this Wendigo and fight him properly. Okay. Okay, block's working now. Wow. Was he hurting us? I'm looking back at my screen to see. Oof. Okay, yeah, he hurt us in that first hit. So that's our own fault. I like how we just, like, we're at the beginning, but he just, like, threw down a bandage. Like, here, good luck. I don't think we have anything to really recover health with too much. I don't know the rune command for it. Yeah, no, I don't. I'm supposed to auto equip my lexicon. What the heck? A paladinium mine and a trap. It's a good thing I ran over that. Back to the fire boys. Now we got Laywell. Awesome. Fire horse. Naked chick, which I can't do anything with. Ooh. Oh, no, I rolled past that. Thank you. Oh, no. Too much. We're dead anyways. Oh, my God. Okay, well, we are in the forest. Oh my god. What is with my luck today? You know what? We can just run across this. Got it. Oh, 
Oh, well, no longer got disease. So that's cool. Suck it. At least I can kill you. Oh, that sucked, guys. We're going to go back home. Uh, Berg. Yeah. We need more potions and stuff. And, like, the longer we wait, the faster the enemies are going to respawn. So, we can't... We can't, uh... We have to go back there as soon as possible, so... Yeah. That was some crap luck, though. You. This worries me. I want to buy stuff. I want to buy these two. You got any? Nope. Let's hope we need to have some greasy fern for us. We're thirsty, but we don't have to worry about being thirsty. Once we go to sleep in our house, we'll be good. How can I help you? Don't think I've been gone long enough for you to restock, restock yet. Nope. Your food, your general goods. How can I help you? Not general enough. You can have some of our crap though. We'll keep that. I have no use for it. I can, I'll keep it though. You can always find better crap than that, but meh. It is getting hot in here though. <laughs> I am getting like ridiculously hot. I'm sweating. Should not be sweating in my house. Dang it. Store that. Store these. We'll read these. And we'll store the rest of our crap. Do we have any greasy fern in here? I don't even know what I have in this dang chest. I got four. I got the Jade Lich idols. That's actually kind of funny. Okay, now let's rest. Repair. Yeah, all that good jazz. Health's fully burnt. Hopefully eight hours will be enough to re regenerate health. Not quite. We'll just go for a full day. We don't really have to worry about our time. Because, like, we're not on a time crunch quest right now. We're kind of in the middle of, like... Rest. I think. We should be good. Because, like, the three brothers quest that I have... It doesn't have a time limit on there like all the other quests did. Fallen City. Yeah, it just says travel. So we should be good. Why is it hazy? It's like my game is hazy. At least it seemed hazy in the house to me. Uh, we're going to see if the shops have replenished or not. And then we'll head back out. How can I help you? Yeah, I think it takes a couple days, so we'll, we'll take all those. She actually had, uh, she had some stuff, so that's a good thing. We can make some more greasy ferns before we head out. How can I help you? And 
This one has Jack. I was just waving at her, guys. That's all I was doing. That's how we wave in, in Berg. That should be good. We're kind of, we're low on stamina. Which, I don't think there's really anything we can do about it. We can buy some base ones, but it's about the best we can do. I wish there was a recall button so I can go back to where I teleported from. I, I thought there would be, but no, alas, there's not. Okay, I'm just messing with the with the runes. I don't know what they really do fully. Like I never fully explored my build with the runes and whatnot. I just got it to where I get the sword and called it good. So, don't judge me. But I want to go back there and I want to figure out or at least try to kill some more things. We'll see. The one good thing I like about having economy though is if we slam a mana potion or a stamina potion, we basically lose no stamina at all. Except for whenever we attack, but then again at that, it's still negligible because we're not burning through that much stamina. Stamina. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Wrong one. There we go. Uh, we're not going to infuse fire because... Everything down here is flaming, so it'd be kind of pointless. We gotta keep a lookout for that Wendigo, because that Wendigo is going to eat our breakfast. At that point, we'll probably infuse with fire, because then we can throw fireballs at it. And we got Flame Horse to deal with. Wah. Stop it. Oh, we are already dead. Oh my god. Those enemies are tough, especially if you never you don't have any fire resistances. You guys are tough. Frost around you, long as you're at campsite, blah blah blah. We're sick. Again. So we'll dash one of these, uh, which will recede our cold. We don't have any potage this time around. We'll take a potion. Uh, Wendigo is up here, so we'll go ahead and drop one of those and infuse fire. And we'll try to fight the Wendigo at a distance. Don't fully remember where he was at. It's all the flame crap. They're just blocking my way too. That sucks because I just infused fire. Ow. No fair.
Nah. Killed him. Those kind of fights, for some reason, just like up my anxiety to like a billion. Eat fire. I think that actually healed him rather than killing him. Because I swear it looked like his uh, health bar kind of flashed, but it didn't like go down. Okay, so he was down here, right? I don't even remember where the Winnego was at anymore. There he is. Oh, crap. We don't have any stamina. I did not realize I didn't have a... didn't take a stamina potion. Sucks. We're gonna have to hopefully get away from him. Which I can still hear him running behind me, so let's see if we can do this quickly. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Gotta remember R is our friend. Boom. You know what? Nope, we're dead. <sighs> okay, you know what? You know what? This has been fun. Uh, I think an hour long stream is pretty good. I was going to go for longer, but it is really hot in my room. So, I thank you all for who have watched and have wished me a happy birthday. Sorry for my mic. It has been a good birthday. Don't get me wrong really has been um i'm just really hot and i am ready to shut my computer off because my computer dumps heat in my room so to shut my computer off turn my fan on uh it, the whole not world but a lot of areas right now in like unprecedented heat and like where i'm at it, it hit 116 which isn't normal by any means so yeah it's hot my AC cannot keep up. A lot of the ACs around here can't keep up. A lot of them have quit. Like, a lot of people are out. And, you know, bad times. Bad times all, all around. But I think I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to call it here. So I do thank you all for watching. I thank you all who have wished me a happy birthday. And to any future watchers... If you're not already subscribed, definitely recommend subscribing. I don't know how live streams work. I think you can find them afterwards. But yeah, if you're not, if you're not subscribed, I definitely recommend subscribing, yada yada. My brain is turning into soup. So yeah, thank you all for watching and I will see you all in the next episode of Outward, actually, because, oop. Okay, Outward's gone. I didn't think I hit save to quit the menu, but whatever. 
yeah thank you all for watching i'll see y'all in the next episode of outward or if there's any other i mean I'm, i make all kinds of different series and whatnot so you don't have to just go with outward you can go with all kinds of other stuff so yeah i'll see you all in the next one